Oh wow, another Forever VR game. Fourth or fourth? <laughs> I had no idea it's coming out today, so no intro. At this point, I'm just like lost if people actually want to pay for separate games of the same kind of caliber, separated in that way on the store. Like, personally, I don't find it very pleasing. Having said that, I don't know what's current call at all. I think I saw it like in old space, but that's pretty much it. <laughs> it's essentially the same lobby, same UI. You know the drill by now. Let's just go straight to the gameplay. Win by scoring 11 or 21 points by landing backs on the board and in the hole. A back on the board scores one point, a back through the cornhole scores three points. And that seems to be the rules. All right, I think it should be easy. Let's do full race, why not? Grab a back using the trigger, toss it at the board. Forever VR graphics, they are fine, like, they are not bad at all. <laughs> she did it from down. Ooh, okay. Calm down, DJ. I wonder if it's gonna be like sliding or something. I never played Cornhole. Woohoo! <laughs> the sound effects. Whoa! Airmail. Excuse me? Let's see like that. Okay. <laughs> I know Forever VR has like skins and stuff like that, that's why we have different stuff going on. Oh my god. <laughs> Are they that heavy? <laughs> Wait, I can move though. Damn it, it didn't count. It seems easy, but all the sliding and stuff can be tricky. It's kind of like a petanque. In France we have balls that you roll on the ground. Also like the board is tilted. Okay. Total fail. The physics seem to work very well, but that was always a thing with Forever. How is this an easy difficulty? Wow. <laughs> Also, it's kind of like a point system of pushing. Okay, I get it. I don't want to play more, I know the drill. Those are Oculus avatars. Oh, excuse me, meta avatars. Cartoony stuff. It's pretty much a classic forever experience. Like every game at this point is the same. Is this like 15 euro worth of gameplay? I mean, you tell me. Every game is like that. I guess bowling is the most, like, expansive. Am I trashing those developers? <laughs> they brought it on themselves. Like, I really think of this series. Because it's a series at this point. 
as being a compilation like Wii Sports. That makes sense to me. Oh, I think I'm gonna win. For once, you can manage with different colors, designs, leaderboards. That's why I say it's the same thing over and over. It's just the game changes, which is what they want. But I don't like that kind of developer design overall. The gameplay, however, works pretty well. Physics, great. Nothing really wrong with it. It's just I'm over with the decisions overall, but that's how it is. <laughs>